Howdy, lieutenants and economists. The most volatile, evil, disgusting things on the planet, humans. If you have a video request, you can always go to assholeconsulting.com. Yeah, I am gonna charge you, kids. And that is the importance of not fucking up. You are such an asshole! Hey everybody, Eric Clary here. And you can go to assholeconsulting.com and I will give you the elderly brotherly advice from the elder brother you never had. Or maybe you had an older brother, but he was a pussy and he majored in English. He wrote poetry for the girl that he liked. And you're like, wow, my, my older brother's a pussy. Wish there was a manly guy around to like kind of be my older brother. Would tell me things that my dad and my pussy brother never. And then, hey, look, here, here's Asshole Consulting. Hey, Cappy, I'm an 18-year-old living in New York, currently in the middle of his second semester of college. I'm undecided on my major and just getting my gen eds out of the way. Good. I go to a city school for free because of uh, financial aid. I even get $2,000 back in refunds each semester. My problem is figuring out what to major in. My school has all the run-of-the-mill me run degrees, including or excluding engineering, so it's not a real school. Computer science information science would probably be the best objective degrees offered, but I tried a bit of programming and wasn't exactly passionate about it. My long-term goal is to be an entrepreneur and own some sort of business, but I don't have any business ideas yet. That being said, my short-term goal is to graduate from college, find a job ASAP, and be able to afford a place on my own. My short-term or at least with roommate, without having to worry about paying next month's rent. What major slash degree would get me a job pretty quickly after I graduate? graduate while also supporting my goal of owning my own business. I was thinking majoring in accounting with marketing or a finance major or should I stop being a bitch and get a degree in computer science? I'm shit scared about being unemployed after college and living with my parents until I'm 30. Employability above all else. I'm anticipating moving out of New York City and or drop out, but let's assume I can't do either of those. I prefer to remain anonymous. Thanks. Okay, um... <laughs> In the, seriously, no more than five years ago, I probably would have recommended accounting because it is a way for you to get a good job. Uh, but then also, it's it's the must-needed skill uh, to to be an entrepreneur and run your own business. But man, that accounting and the requirements and the progressive credentialism and a lot of people are going into accounting. I'm I'm kind of getting cooler and cooler on it as time goes on. It'll get you a job, but it, it ain't going to be the greatest paying job. What I would do is is one of two things. Quit being a bitch and go computer science, computer engineering, or go to another school and get an actual engineering degree. Uh, you, you're 18. You don't know shit about the real world. You're not going to come up with an entrepreneurial idea today or tomorrow. Let's admit it. You're not a fucking Mark Zuckerberg. You're not a fucking Bill Gates. That's one in, in, one in 400 million when you consider how many people have died. Maybe even 500 million uh, how many people have died over their lifetimes. And Steve Jobs is dead on top of it. Uh, you're not going to be that guy, okay? So I would start putting your investments and your education uh, resources and, and studies into a field that is going to guarantee you a job. And that just means you're going to have to go into STEM of some kind. Chemical engineering, electrical engineering, petroleum's a little weak. You know, you can look it up. Another thing you can do is go online and look up starting salaries. I mean, you can do this yourself. Uh, or the trades. That's the other option I was thinking. Uh, because the trades, you invariably, with the trades, you do become your own person, your own boss. You do become your own employer. Because you, after a while of working under somebody, you say, well, why the fuck should I work for you? I can do this on my own, hang my own shingle outside my roof, and hey, Bob's plumbing, and there you go. Uh, and it may not pay as much as engineering, but it's a damn good skill to have, be it you know welding, plumbing, being an electrician whatever else it is uh, and then huh, it will definitely get you into the mindset of becoming an entrepreneur but if you if you're set on going to school for four years don't fucking piss away that time or your money get a real degree and do it right and then what will happen is when you get into engineering or the sciences or stem is you'll start to understand the uh, that market and the industry more. Because 18, you don't know shit about the market or in the industry. Hell, at my age, I don't know shit about the market or in the industry because I haven't studied. I haven't been in it. So it's going to take years for you 
to learn the basics about the industry, figure out where it's evolving to or where it's evolved from, and then capitalize, say, oh, I think it's gonna go this way, and then come up with a genuine business idea. So do not put this idea, well, I wanna become self-employed and, and never work for anybody ever again. Well, yeah, that's not gonna happen to you because you just don't know. You don't have enough real world experience to start having the, 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 the observational skills to realize where there are markets and where there are opportunities. Now, if that happens tomorrow, don't say, well, shit, I'm only 18. I get No, if you find a market, fucking run for it. Absolutely, dude. But I'm just saying <clears throat> it's unlikely to happen between now and then. So you might as well, I'd say, if it was me, if it was about like when I was 23, 24, I started thinking outside the box. Doesn't mean you're going to be me, but I'm just saying, at 18, oh, my God, you're going to be too busy undoing all the fucking brainwashing you received at K through 12. So I would not bother. I mean, don't even bother thinking about entrepreneurship until you're 23 or 24. I mean, if you come up with an idea, of course, pursue it. But your brain isn't really going to be <clears throat> deprogrammed or experienced um, or in that mindset or evolved enough to like start looking with that eagle eye for your entrepreneurial idea. So in short, you're not going to have any business ideas until what I estimate to be about at least 23, 24, 25. So in the meantime, stop fucking around. Get yourself a real degree. Don't piss away your time. So at minimum, you don't have to worry about food, clothing, and shelter, okay? You're not going to live at home with your parents. And in doing that, you will come up with different ideas and observations uh, that would make potentially good business ideas. I'm, I'm sick of these 18-year-old kids. I'm, I'm going to start my own business. Yeah, and what? I don't know. Well, that's because you haven't worked in the real world and you don't know anything about the real world or the markets or any. And so I'm very curious to see what you think is going to be an entrepreneurial idea. So this isn't to besmirch you. It's to tell you not to be a fucking 18-year-old douche and think, that, oh, I'm going to become a business major. I'm going to be business. I'm going to be an entrepreneur. Really? Okay. That requires an idea before a degree. So <clears throat> that's what I would do. Um... Stop being a bitch and get a degree. Yeah, stop being a bitch. Not necessarily computer science. Don't don't think like the only options you have is what that school offers. If you want to go into chemistry, go into chemistry. Find another school. Drop the extra money. I mean, you're make you're not even paying any fucking money as you get money back for God's sake. Um, so yeah, real science degree, real STEM degree, real profession, and then down the road start thinking. But you know, keep your eye open the entire time for op uh, entrepreneurial um, endeavors and options. And opportunities, but I would, yeah, while you're in college, don't fuck around. Get yourself a real degree. Best of luck. Toodles.